the House of Representatives is seeking to separate the office of the Attorney General of the Federation from that of the Minister of Justice, saying this separation will remove political interference in the operations of the Attorney General. A bill to alter the 1999 Constitution to separate the two offices sponsored by the Chief Whip of the House, Mohammed Tahir Monguno, scaled through the second reading at Tuesday's plenary. Monguno said he was sponsoring the bill based on his experience as a former Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice in Borono State, adding that at the moment too much power was vested on the Minister of, or Commissioner for Justice in combining the two offices. Right, we, with respect to the, I mean, over the years there's been the clamor about the separation of the AGF from the Minister of Justice. How tenable is this? Let's hear from you, Chindu. Well, I, I guess the, the clamor has been. And from, from a perspective, the clamour has been fueled by the fact that um, people think that there is a conflict of interest between both offices. Okay. And uh, maybe that there's, in some instances, abuse. Um, and so the clamour has been there, but I think more recently there's been a recent push and in the media. I think that even the National Assembly has um, mooted the idea of commencing the process of um, separating the offices. So it's, um, uh, it's um, a tenable clamor, if you like, whether it, it, it's practicable or whether it will, it will um, be achieved within this administration is something that remains to be seen. We can say. Yes. All right, Tumi, let's hear from you. I, I completely agree with Chinidum. I think it's a very tenable position. Crucial, and I mean, it's crucial, the, a, a major theme to that argument is that there appears to be some conflict between the okay. rules of an okay. Attorney General of the Federation as well as the Minister of Justice. Now, the Minister of Justice would operate as any other minister appointed by the federal government or by the presidency and is by nature then sort of um, answerable to the to government, the whereas the role of an Attorney General should be to act exactly on behalf of the citizen, citizenry. And as we may be aware, sometimes the policies of the federal government may actually be at loggerheads, as it were, with, mm -hmm. with what the aspirations of the citizen, citizenry really is. 